This is how it happened. This is how Merck's mashups die. Welcome gamers to West Gaming Live. Today on West Gaming Live, we're playing Batman Arkham Knight. I'm All Merck. Right. Today gamers, we're going to be showing you how to get the 100% achievement in Batman Arkham Knight. First, what you're going to want to do is crash into every car on the street just a little bit. Just to tenderize the Batmobile. <laughs> Right, I'm Merc, and uh, and I'm here with Zach CG. Yeah, I definitely am here. I'm experiencing Batman for the very first fucking time. I've never played any of these games. So, we gotta take out these tanks. Because they're a problem. Are these, like, where are all these fucking coming from? <laughs> I should really not be asking questions like this. Oh but yeah, they got they got like APCs in this city. Okay, so basically the entire like uh, like all of Batman's villains just bankrolled this um, private army to take on um, Batman. I need the isolation chamber prep. Cool. They pooled all their money together. Okay. Oh, AR challenge is revealed. A series of diagnostic simulations to test the various functions of the suit and Batmobile. Simply select the appropriate program, and the Bat computer will provide a navigational marker. Okay, we won't be doing these. Ah. Thank you, Alfred. Hey, let me ask you something. So, Batman's villains have like a, like they talk to each other and work together and shit. Like they have like a like a league of villains. Oh, no, 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 you ain't getting away. You ain't getting away. Another disgusting criminal off the streets. But do Batman's villains do that? Oh, yeah, by the way, when you run people over... Um, in this game, they do. Um, in previous games, they kind of hated each other. Um, but in this game, they've come together. So, I feel like that's, oh, um... they keep dodging, they oh, keep ahead. dodging. Okay, so when you run people over in the Batmobile, like it sends like an electric shock to like say, oh no, you didn't run them over, you just tased them a little. But still, you hit them at like upwards wow. of like, of like 90 miles an hour. So I don't, I mean. That's such a band-aid over that. <laughs> it just sends out an electrical shock. Don't worry, you people in, is, people in Gotham are durable. I have a, I have a, I have a really heady uh, Batman idea for you. Are you ready? Think about this. You know how they do that shit in video games because they're trying not to break the rules of Batman's character and like with the fear cater to and fans. You know, it's, it's like, hey, Batman's not supposed longer. to just brutally murder people all the time in his Dalsh character. Have so far. I have a second alternate explanation. Drive? I forgot she was in the back seat that whole time. Yep. Yep. You just brought her out like luggage. <laughs> anyway, but you know how they do that? They like make the Batmobile tase people instead of just running them over? Yeah. I have a second theory. That's not for the audience. That's for Batman. Like Batman makes that tase thing to give himself plausible back. deniability. Honestly, so he can say, no, I don't kill people. Think about that. What if it's in universe to give himself plausible liability? Look, I didn't kill them by running over them with the Batmobile. I killed them by electrocuting them beforehand. No, he could totally like testify and be like, "Well, look, my Batmobile. If people get close to it, it's supposed to shock them. So, you know, I designed it not to kill. You could use that as a shield." Oh, good, another cell. I mean, so they keep her. They like keep her. No, they keep her in this isolation chamber, um, specifically to keep uh, her from using her powers to break out. See, she's referencing the events of that um, story pack. Ah. On the streets, will do everything in their power to make sure it stays that way. Now, you all had your chance to evacuate. 
You all made your choices. <laughs> you all had your chance to ejaculate. Every one of you. You all made your choices. When this is over. But the work starts now. Priority one. We're here to save lives, and it starts with the lives of your fellow officers right here at this precinct. I want a minimum of four guys on the roof at all times, and a six-man element patrolling the perimeter. We keep and a six-man elephant down. The only people that get cars. in or out are our guys and the Batman. Now those punks out there think they own this city. And as things stand, right now I know things right look then, bad, guys. I know things bad. look bad, guys. Smart, but we'll the truth is, they actually are bad. Piece by piece. <laughs> I wish right when he said that, for oh, our guys Bristol, and the Kingston, Batman. Thresher, I wish all the police officers had been like Adam. the Batman. What are you? Oh choppers, shit! Like they didn't notice guys, he was right behind them. No mistake, we are not in control. Until we know what we're dealing with out there, until we have a solid lead on Scarecrow. Our priority is to dig in here and look out for our own. Any questions? Yeah, can we get some coffee in here? Okay, I'm gonna run through this one more time. Okay, so you just gonna clear. be like that priority then? Alright, fine. We're here to save lives. Fuck it, I'll just find I'll just get my own coffee then. Being on this phone is costing lives, sir. This is time I don't have. Gordon. Screw you. Where'd you get that cup of co Damn coffee? Pure How can I get one? We're on our own. Seriously, I could I use know, some coffee. No I've been coffee seriously, I could use some coffee. I've been up, up for like 48 hours, Gordon. Cash, give us a rundown. All right, let's see. I'm not performing at optimal capacity. Up, I need my goddamn caffeine, Gordon. 17. We've got their last known coordinates, but they're not going to survive out there on their own for long. Then there's this. It's a strange one. Body turned up. We didn't have long to look before the evacuation, but the forensics boys seem freaked out. Real loud. Also, we've had several sightings of the Riddler creeping around the train yard. No okay, so we're gonna have we're, we're gonna have movie. some choices, Zach. Look, mm. I know you're busy, but anything you can do to help is going to save lives. Don't worry, Jim. I have someone working a lead on Scarecrow. I'll see what I can do. Good to hear. I've got a skeleton crew searching Gotham South and West. I'm going to join him when I'm done here. We're going to find that son of a bitch. We're going to find that Fernandez, son of a bitch. Gordon, give Referring me to the coffee machine, which has gone missing. All right, gamers. Time for our West Gaming Live interactive section. Uh, leave us a comment oh with um, which side mission you think we should go after first. Do you think we should start with the Riddler? who has uh, been seen around the train yard, the missing His firefighters from Station ugly. 17, or the perfect crime, another body has been found. Ishmael. Are we actually having people leave comments? I mean, this isn't live. You're right, it's not live. Uh, so, Zach, what do you think we should do first? Do you think we should go All to right, that body? Well... Check out the Riddler? Or do this side quest, which I think is awful. Oh, well, you've narrowed it down for me, haven't you? Well, it's it's um... it's not it's not that it's awful; it's just not interesting. Uh, this is another one of those things that I'll be doing like off camera mostly. Okay, so then our choices are Riddler or the next Ishmael. Personally, I'm go ahead and say Riddler, just because yeah. it's closer. And well, variety's okay. sake, you know. Let's uh. Gotcha. I'm going after Riddler. But his shirt is phenomenally ugly. Yeah, he's got like a Hawaiian thing going on with like God um. How we got out without shooting I mean, I like Hawaiian the shirts, that but that one's pretty with like question hard. marks. Hey, Batman. Yeah, no, I, I, guess I don't Scarecrow fuck with that shirt. Gave you the slip. In the slightest. You broke my wrist for nothing. He's got plans for you, Batman. You and all your friends. Tonight's the night we finally break the bat. That sounds interesting. Are you sure we can't do it tomorrow? I've already about, been up for a very long time. How about you take a nap? Long time. Yeah. And tonight's the night, huh? Boom! <laughs> All right. He's unconscious. He's going to miss it. All right. Let's go after Riddler. This thing's had a serious Sure. Upgrade. Air support saw it turn into some kind of tank. Nice. Don't get too close. He's here. Back up. All right, let's get in the Batmobile. The car, the fucking 
starts driving ahead at 70 miles per hour while you're still, like, standing on top of it getting in. Well, okay, yeah, check this out. Check this out. Hold on. Check this out. Alright. Oh, damn it. That didn't actually work. I wasn't standing far enough away. Give me a second. Oh, nope. That's not the button I wanted. Uh, damn it. Oh, okay. God. Here it is. It started driving towards you. That was quite scary. Yeah, check it out. I can control it remotely. You can just remote pilot that shit? Can you run into yourself? Oh, here's what happens when you tr when you do that. You will not be spared. And to Batman, I have all now oh, I'm in the Batmobile. Right in? Yep. That's really cool. It controls very. Like, it's an elegant solution. It's amazing, like how. Do that. It's amazing how like. Batman? Oh yeah. By the way, Scarecrow's saying some shit on the on the PA, but like, who cares? I have eradicated the entire supply of Gotham City's Java beans. You bastard! Why, hello there, detective. Yes, it's me. Your most feared. Oh, you don't even tr crack the top ten, Riddler. For you have arrived early for this, the next generation of my riddles. Okay, we have a choice coming up. We have a choice coming up. Do you want me to um, uh, listen to all of the Riddler's um, ridiculous like dialogue, or do you want me to skip it and and humiliate him? Uh, definitely the second option. I would like to. Um, okay, see okay, but out. okay, but wait, wait until wait until we get to it, so you can make your choice there. Cause, okay. check, Cause it's gonna be. You are staring with stupefied incomprehension at a mechanism I have calibrated to respond to an extremely This is a tough puzzle. In a moment, I will give you the decrypted code, Dark Knight. Oh, but first, I think we should run through the calls you that? for tonight's festivities. Rule the first. You will address me at all. Okay. He's got a lot of these rules. Mr. Nigma. Do you want to sit through all these rules, or should we? Or should we? No. Fucking activate Riddler blockade. How integrated microphone? How did you? How did you solve tonight's very first riddle? Well done. All right. Welcome to my racetrack, detective. You must complete It's a race. What? Finishing each before yep. time limit expires. This is the new thing with Riddler. Is, you got to do races? Let's put that grotesque ego mobile to the test. Hey, you know what? I understand now why people are saying they push the Batmobile too hard. Right? I feel like this has nothing to do with Riddlers. I just said Riddlers. With Riddlers? So nothing to do with riddles. Oh shit! Like, why would like think about why would the Riddler build a giant underground racetrack? Does he even have a car? Does he like driving? Is it in his character? Point. Oh, this is kind of cool. What yeah. Mean, like the Riddler built this. It's kind of weird. Um, I think Arkham City was like um, a year ago, maybe. And this isn't even the only one. No, I didn't think it was. I'm disabling the afterburner failsafe. I need the extra speed. I'm shocked, Dark Knight. Is that really as fast as it goes? So you don't actually have to use the afterburner at all on this first course. As long as you, um, as long as you don't mess up. There we go. This first course is very generous. Will those things just move into place when you get there? Or nope. Is it like I'm control. I'm controlling them. I'm pressing B. Oh. 
Oh, I see the thing that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now pay attention to. Okay, yeah, that actually is a little bit more engaging. I thought it was doing it automatically because you were hitting. Nope. It perfectly oh every time. shit! Oh god! Sweet lord, no! Sweet Jesus. Hey, uh, I'm gonna read something to you. Have you seen this? Have you heard this? Have you read this? Oh god! I forced the bot to watch over a thousand hours of Batman, and then asked it to write a Batman script. Oh yeah, yeah, I've, I've heard of this. It's hilarious. Did I send this to you? Oh, uh, go start? ahead. Go ahead and read it for the audience, if they don't you know what we're to, talking just about. To, just to do the do the race, have something lively happen. <clears throat> Batman, interior, traditional Batcave. Batman stands next to his Batmobile and uses me. his Bat computer. He's sometimes Bruce Wayne, sometimes Batman, all times orphan. Batman, this is now a safe city. I have punched a penguin into prison. Alfred, Batman's loyal battler, carries a tray of goth ham. Alfred, <laughs> eat a dinner, Mattress Wayne. <laughs> An explosion explodes. The Joker and Two-Face enter the cave. Joker is a cl clown, but insane. Two-Face is a man, but an attorney. Batman, <laughs> no, it is Two-Face and One-Face. They hate me for being a bat. Batman throws Alfred at Two-Face. Two-Face flips Alfred like a coin. Alfred lands heads up, which means Two-Face goes home. Batman continued. It is just you and I, the Joker. Bat versus Clown. Moral enemies. The Joker. I am such a freak! Society is bad! You drink water, I drink anarchy. Batman. I drink bats, just like a bat would! Batman looks around for his parents, but they are still dead. This makes him have anger. He fires a bat rocket. The Joker deflects it with his sick sense of humor. A clownly power. Joker, I have never followed a rule. That is my rule. Do you follow? I don't. <laughs> Batman, Alfred, give birth to Robin. Oh, Alfred God. begins the process since it is his job. The Joker now has a present in his hand. He juggles it over to Batman. The Joker, happy bat day, Birthman. Batman opens the present since he's a good guy. It contains a coupon for new parents, but is expired. This is a Joker joke. <laughs> I love that so much. Two-Face flips out Alfred like a coin. He lands heads up, which means Two-Face goes home. <laughs> Did you really believe that a challenge designed by me, the Riddler, would be quite so easy? Oh, dark night. Oh no, we have to do more of these. It wouldn't. Still, thanks to your unrelated but not right now. Showboat, I now have wow, several this is a mouthy guy. Relating to that latest model of rocket-powered hearse you're driving. Naturally, I shall be using this data to calibrate further challenges and trials. You know what I'll this soon, detective. should be filled by? This come. position? Is there a Batman villain who has, like, an interest in machines or something? Um, like there's up cars in his spare time. Uh, I'm trying to think. Um, I know there's, there's I, I know there's like, one, but I can't remember his name. Imagine there's a villain who like doesn't hate Batman that much, and they just want to race him, you know? And they're like really interested in the capabilities of the Batmobile and like building a course it can't defeat. That would sort of be cool and make okay. sense, but I don't know so, how that is supposed to be in the Riddler's character. So we got story like, mission. Why does he care about testing the Batmobile, you know? We got the next story mission available. We got, um, we still got the firefighters and we got, Bullshit um, ass firefighters. This... I think we should do at least one of these on camera just so you can see the deal. Um, oh, but we really? also, but we also got this one. Um, so what do you think next? Let's do the, let's do the, the firefighters. All right. Let's go. The missing fire crew's not safe on these streets. I'll start by checking Dixon Dock West. That was their last reported location. Is this... Is the video game driving... Whoa, in this hold gun? on. How is the handling? It Excuse like me. Excuse me, sir. Like... Oh, 
boy. Oh! Oh! Oh my god! I thought you were done hitting that guy like three times. Riddler, tell me what you know. All right, I'll talk. Just don't hurt me. Good. So, the craziest thing about these Riddler informants is sometimes they'll actually, like, try to hit you while you're holding them. And you can counter mm. that. That's cool. All right. Hold on. My... Hey, Chris, can you still hear me? Okay, cool. My uh, my screen froze for a minute, but we're good now. Oh, there's only there's only like what five of you? Oh, this is gonna be this. I'm I feel bad for you guys, honestly. Oh, get, get in there. He's gonna fucking get tortured really soon. Oh, I feel so bad for you guys. Oh! How dare you grab me! Oh, you can pick people up off the ground, by the way. Like, when you knock them cool. down, you can pick them up into a beatdown. Oh, wow. Oh! Oh, there was actually like a, um... Oh, it was this thing. Okay, you're gonna... I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to, like, um... The next time you see, like, a weird-looking environmental object um, near a fight, remind me that I have to, like, uh, knock somebody into it. Try and... Batman. Yeah, do a finisher with it. God, it's really you. What happened? Because I'm just messing up uh, on these. Was attacked. The rioters Dude, Batman... One by one. We were separated. Looks like... Taken away. Please, they're gonna kill us. I'll save your crew. Wait here. I'll get a GCPD officer to pick you up. I don't know if I'm extremely impressed with this Batman. He sort of just looks like he's staring straight forward. Oh, don't like worry. A video game model. Don't worry. It'll get it'll get cooler. And his voice lines are like, "I'm going to the next objective." Bye. Okay. So, let's just grab this um, perfect crime, and then we can Ishmael. go to do the story yeah. the story Someone mission. Sounds nice. Oh, and it's in the right direction too. So which which number game in the, is this in the Arkham series? Okay, so there was Arkham Asylum, then there was Arkham City, right. then Arkham Origins, right. and then this one, right. Arkham Knight. Right. So this is so, four. This is four. So four is the one where like the city's completely overrun, and you're fucking. Because I'm thinking like that's pretty cool. Like think about it as like. A trilogy of games, if you exclude the prequel, a Alpha, trilogy of games like body. set the in the same city, but the city, like the play movie. area, keeps expanding and, and changing. And then in the third one, it's just an absolute war missed. zone. And That's pretty cool. This get any worse. Yeah. I'm going to scan the body for unique identifiers. Deep tissue. Ah. Of course. The ear. Oh yeah, absolutely. Deformity on the left ear. What can we Looks know like about that? Looks like a result that? of minor ear agenesis, a birth defect. Okay. Gotcha. Now what do we got at the muscle level? Oh, here we go. Uh, a he wedding swallowed ring a ring. Tested. It looks like. The inscription reads Ophelia. Okay, that should narrow it down a lot more than just like um, than just well, like to twenty six people. Twenty six matches. Okay, but yeah, but like, check this out. Like, he swallowed a ring. How many people have like the have that in their medical profile? Do you think? Well, I don't know. It could have just happened. I think it would only narrow it down to people married to. This requires like a food. healthy amount of like sus of like suspension of disbelief for mo for a lot of these. True. Because like, I mean, ah, this here we is go. Like, have you ever seen Psych? The, the show Psych. Hip replacement, scar tissue. No, but I've heard of it. Must have been recent. The well, name is Sean Anthony Spencer Lund. in that show, he's not an actual psychic, he's just very perceptive. Alcoholism. So he goes in to like, the room, the and he sees some marriage. things, and it's sort of like... The name on the ring. Sorry, I'll let Batman him. talk. His ex-wife. He was last seen in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Another person taken from outside the Gotham area. A significant detail, sir. 
So are these words written beside the bodies. Try oh yeah, by the way. Between the two victims I've found. Flawed. Oh, you saw that. You saw it, right? Lincoln. When it was on the screen yeah. before. I'll try my best, sir. Flawed. Okay, anyway, you were saying about um but, but, but like Sean will go into a room and it'll it'll do like that thing where he zooms in with his eyes and it goes Ooh, and it like highlights something and it's showing the audience like he noticed something about it. It's important. And then uh, he'll make to other people like he had a psychic vision and it revealed that information to him. And he'll do like a big song and dance fucking like. Yeah. All right. So let's get to that story mission then. So we've exhausted all of our side quests. For shoes. And we're like, you could summarize your whole life. The show takes shortcuts similarly to the system in this game. You analyze like three things and you know everything about them. And it's like, okay, I'll suspend my disbelief for that. Well, it's actually like, like the suspension of disbelief is, um, is like, uh, oh. Thinking, I lost my train of thought. I ain't staying to find out. The thugs have such like, they have such voices. Oh, nice. So the suspension of disbelief I'm actually referring to is um. Like, you scan, like, something, and it tells you, like, oh, he's got a wedding ring in his lower intestine. And, like, that's something that, like, would narrow it down to, like, a lot narrower, I think, than, like, the, uh, like, 128 or whatever um, that it would give you if you scanned it as your first thing. Like, I could have scanned that first. I could have scanned that first. About that as if it's, like, we're looking for people with medical conditions where they have a ring in their large intestine your intestine you'd poop that out you know that would cycle through i'm pretty sure that's only in there like after death like he swallowed that pretty close to when he died so i don't know that that would narrow it down oh that makes sense that makes sense people that makes sense ophelia okay i got it i got it okay so 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 the actual thing that it narrowed down was like um people who are or were married mm -hmm. I, I see okay that makes more sense and all right. Let's go see Oracle. Ooh. That's pretty cool. Okay. Toggle detective. So, are you familiar with um with the episode uh the gray beware the gray ghost from um the Batman animated series? I don't think so. I have seen so, some of the Batman animated series. So, Simon like Trent episode where Batman In that dies, episode, in that episode, he's around as a ghost. In that episode, Simon Trent plays, um, or actually, rather, um, the actor Simon Trent, um, who played um, Batman's childhood hero, the Grey Ghost, um, from an old TV series he would watch with his father. He's actually voiced hmm. by Adam West. Oh, nice. That's pretty cool. So that's a cool little Easter egg there. Um, Have you... Have you heard about um, the Flash movie? Because um, you were talking about DC Fandom before. The, is there a new one? Yes. Oh, I haven't There's heard of this. There's a Flash movie that's going to come out. And it's going to be like Flashpoint, you know? They're going to have... Um, Makes sense. New oh Flash yes, the, actually, actually, I heard. Actually, I heard it was gonna have like, um, it was gonna have uh, Michael Keaton, Michael and, Keaton, um, and Batfleck, and Batfleck. Okay, let's. Um, yeah, that's what I wanted to bring up. I so mean, that's kind of cool. They're doing Into the Batverse a little bit. So the classic, that. the classic um, William Shakespeare bust hiding the um, entrance to the Bat Cave or whatever. Retinal scanner. Gotcha. Oh boy. This is just inside the clock tower? That's where the yep. cave is? What if it's somebody not... just flies a plane into it? Uh, well, I thought then the I... point of the cave was that it was like secure in a cave. 
This isn't actually like the Bat Cave. This is actually where um, Oracle hangs out. That's um, oh, okay. Barbara Gordon. This is just like the forward operating base. Yeah. Yeah, but for real though, the Oracle should get a more secure location. Someone could just 9-11 this joint. Do I come in the Bat Cave? Start messing with all your stuff? You've managed to reduce the compound to its core elements. But there's nothing in there that we can trace. What if we'd been looking at this the wrong way? Instead of searching for the toxin, what if we focus on the manufacturing process? Why didn't I see this? This is just the techno babble. Is a unique radiation spike. Run a scan of the you city know? for this energy signature. It will show where Scarecrow is creating a sphere toxin. Um, it, take a few hours it makes a little sense. It's like, um... No, uh, that's the, like, the point of techno studios. babble. It I needs forget to the... be something that Bruce, like logically follows. You know, it makes I sense. You can I infer. I lying to him. He'd kill me if he knew I was still in the city. He still blames himself for this. There are certain like we'll radiation signatures right. that different elements have. Like when you run like um, uh, light through them, they make different colors. You know. The uh, emission spectrum, that's what it's called. Um, can't use this right now. Um, this is exactly, uh, this is exactly techno babble. It needs to be just too complex for the average person to turn their brain off and be like, right, they're just saying science words. But not so complex that it's actually real science that we're using, you know? It just is placeholder. It needs to be right in the middle there. Well, there's also like a little bit like, um, people who understand like, uh, the science that they're referring to um, is actually like um, like they like they list they uh, listen to it and say okay yeah that makes a little bit of sense yeah it's good techno babble way to find out where I don't want to say it's uh, not criticizing what can I do? techno babble has its Get place your men ready as soon as we've got a location Star I'll let Trek you know. used right. it to great effect. All right, Zach, um, that's actually going to be it for these uh, 30 minutes on um, this uh, crossover episode between um, Merck's Mashups and West Gaming Live. Um, what did you think of the Batman? Well, um, weird that the Riddler constructs giant racetracks underground. But other than that, pretty sick game so far. Pretty cool. All like right. And viewers, what did you think of Batman Arkham Knight? Leave us a comment. Tell us what you think. What you think of this series. Uh, if you like this series, make sure to leave a like rating and subscribe. Click the bell icon if you're not already. And um, be sure and to check out. Tune in next time for another sh sick episode of Achievement Hunter with Jack and Jeff. All right, everybody. Tune in next time Peace for out. West. Ga tune in next time on, on West Mashups for West Gaming Live. When we're going to be playing, I don't know, we might be playing anything. Uh, but if you want to follow this series, make sure to make sure to head on over to Merck's Mashups, where we'll have part three of this exciting Let's Play. We'll catch you next time. Later. Hey, hey. see you next time. Goodbye.